Hello and welcome to the session of Filter Aids in Pharmaceutical Process. This is Suresh Kumar Paswan, Assistant Professor in Department of Pharmacy, SGS ITS Indore. Today we are going to discuss filter aid in pharmaceutical process. Talking about filter, uh, filtration, uh, it is very important unit operation in our pharmaceutical area. It is uh, used in uh, filtration of slurries, uh, uh, preparation of uh, syrups, uh, it is used in aseptic processing. So, uh, like uh, it is used in syringe filters, it is used in uh, bulk drug industries where uh, uh, the solid is separated uh, from the liquid. So, it's a very important operation, unit operation in our uh, pharmaceutical area. Talking about filtration, it's a process in which solid is separated from the fluid with the help of septum. So, septum, this is called filter media. Let us see. Uh, So this is a, a septum, it is a filter media, uh, the filter paper what we are using is uh, known as septum and the solid uh, uh, free fluid which is obtained is filtrate, so this portion is called filtrate and uh, the deposit of the solid formed on the septum, so whatever it is deposited or residues which are obtained is known as septum or cake. So uh, next talking about uh, filtration process. So uh, normally when we go for filtration what happens like uh, if uh, the solution we are going to filter uh, the slurry will come, uh, the solution, uh, the filtrate it will come down uh, from this particular area. Uh, this is the filter paper or the septum and uh, the gap which is present over here, the, uh, the solution it will come and the solid, uh, the substance it will remain on the surface. So what happened after some times, like after, uh, uh, after a few minutes or few hours, uh, this uh, uh, the solid particle hits, goes and clogs the this pores. So all the pores are being clogged over here and uh, gradually it reduces the rate of filtration and slowly it will uh, stop the filtration process. So what happens, like uh, we use filter aids to prevent uh, the filter media from getting blocked. So uh, these filter aids, these are the external substance which we use to mix into the solution or we use to uh, prepare a pre-coat uh, by which uh, uh, the rate of filtration is increased. So filter aids, these are the uh, solid substance or the powder which are used as a fil uh, which used to prevent the medium from getting blocked. So talking about the application of uh, filter aids, like there are two kind of application, one is pre-coat application, another one is uh, uh, pre-mix filter. So talking about uh, pre-coat, so uh, as we know, uh, this is a filter media or the filter paper uh, and this area is the uh, pores which are present over here. So these are the pores and the small white particles, uh, these, are called, uh, these are all called filter aids. So this filter aid, it separates uh, this particular uh, substance, this is our uh, solid particles and this portion, this white portions, these are all called filter aid. So they prepare some fine channels by which the liquid, uh, it will slowly percolate and filter through uh, your media. So uh, here all the liquid, it will uh, slowly, it will move down and uh, the process of clogging it will be reduced so likewise uh, we are making a pre-coat in pre-coat what we are doing we are preparing a slurry and we are pre uh, filtering uh, those slurry of uh, filter aid and then we are uh, filtering our uh, slurries or uh, the desired slurries another one is premix in premix what we used to do we used to uh, add filter aid through the slurry so what happened, uh, these white white particles, if you see, uh, these are all filter aids and it forms a torturous path for the liquid to go down. So if this is a uh, filter media or filter paper, we are having gap over here, uh, slowly the solution it will move down and it will go down. So what happens, uh, in pre-mix, uh, the slurry, uh, uh, the filter aid is mixed with the uh, slurry and uh, they find uh, uh, fine paths for uh, the solution to move down and the rate of filtration is uh, increased or uh, uh, it is improved. So uh, talking about the ideal properties of the filter aid, these are uh, uh, these should be chemically inert, it should not react with your solution. Uh, like in our pharmaceutical area, what we used to do, we used to uh, take organic solvents uh, 
so it should not uh, react with uh, with, uh, with the solution and it should not it be uh, compressible uh, the solu uh, generally what happens like uh, whatever the material what we are using if it uh, compresses it will go and block the pores like uh, here uh, if it compresses then it will block the pores so it should be not compressible and it should be insoluble with the filter media it should not be soluble if it is soluble then uh, it will stop acting it should be used over wide range in pressure drop like in the pharmaceutical area we used uh, nitrogen pressure so it should be used in various uh, high pressure uh, areas also it should be economic uh, surely it should be economic it should not uh, have big cost uh, uh, so it will increase the cost of uh, our pharmaceutical uh, preparations it should not prepare uh, impart fiber of the particle the fiber if we are using fiber or particle uh, it should be big enough uh, so that uh, it should be filtered through that particular filter pa paper and it should be not toxic it should not react with the solution it should not impart its toxicity into the solution so there are some example of the filter aids there are uh, various uh, uh, substances which are used as a filter aid like kesselgar diatomic salt matter uh, it's a uh, 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 ch charcoal, kaolin, asbestos uh, cellulose, volcano glass, perlite and bentonite. These are some classical examples of uh, filter aids. Talking about Kesselgar, if you will see uh, Kesselgar, if you will uh, uh, take this uh, uh, powder of Kesselgar and observe over microscope, you will find very fine structures. What is Kesselgar? Actually, it is a diatomic earth matter or fossilized powder. So, fossilized, as you know, uh, uh, the uh, 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 the, the algae which is uh, present there in the sea it, uh, gets deposited down and uh, uh, if, you, uh, if, you, if you see this structure it is uh, around 50 micron structure and in 50 micron you see very fine pores uh, are there these are the structure, cellular structure of that algae and after uh, remaining in the lo for long period or fossilized uh, time what happened uh, this uh, algae uh, it, uh, it is mineralized and it becomes solidified and these are uh, now used as a uh, uh, as a Kesselgar powder. So these powder they are having very fine structures and this fine structure very fine pores are there. So uh, these pores help us in increasing the rate of flow or it uh, it forms channels and it uh, increases the rate of flow of uh, the liquid. Another one is charcoal. In uh, charcoal also you see fine structures, fine pores are there. Uh, here the uh, uh, the, uh, the uh, the wood is uh, heated to very high temperature in which uh, all the moisture or the cellular substance it diffuses out and only the cell wall is there. So uh, you will see very fine structures are there or fine pores are there uh, which increase the rate of filtration. Another one is perlite. This is uh, uh, volcano glass. Uh, again it is also having uh, very fine structures, fine, pout, uh, fine pores are there and again it will help increase. Asbestos it is, uh, uh, it, it, it is having very fine uh, uh, like a fiber kind of a substance so uh, it will entrap uh, uh, the particle above itself uh, so it will ha act like that other one is bentonite bentonite uh, it acts in a separate way bentonite what happens it uh, make uh, uh, actually there are two kind of substance uh, uh, solutions are there flocculated and deflocculated uh, 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 suspensions are there in deflocculated you will find here uh, very hard cake has been formed so uh, nothing is added over here, uh, your only fine powders are there and this hard cake it will uh, uh, again it will uh, uh, reduce the rate of filtration. So what we used to do is to add very small quantity of bentonite so it will form a flocculated kind of uh, suspension. So flocculated suspension it will form loose flocules and there will be channels, uh, paths, all these paths it will, uh, 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 it will help us to in, uh, increase in rate of flow because uh, the slurry or the solution uh, it will move across through this uh, tortuous path and it will go down and uh, likewise it will increase the rate of filtration and uh, there uh, and it will stop producing very hard cake on the surface of filter medium uh, some part is taken by American filtration uh, separation society by Wu Chen I, uh, Apple, uh, I uh, acknowledge him and thank you for listening